Hackers, cyber criminals and threat actors are selling your personal identifiable information on dark web and you don't know and they are even using it for malicious purposes. Here it is how you can find your information on dark web. Hi guys, this is Arslan and you are watching Threat Hunter. In this video, I will show you how you can run a quick scan to find your personal information on dark web. Hackers infiltrate a database and steals a large amount of data. Most people even don't know their data is up for sale on dark web. Breaches can be so dangerous. At the end of 2022, hackers were selling information of 400 million Twitter users on dark web. Data sales are common on dark web. Up till now, data of 533 million Facebook users has been compromised and even information of 1.8 billion Gmail users has been exposed on dark web as a result of zero-day exploit. Data breaches are increasing day by day, so here are 5 reliable websites that will help you to scan your information on dark web. So don't skip and watch the complete video. First is scan.aura.com. Open your browser and type scan.aura.com. Aura is one of the most reliable website. Scroll down and type in your email address here. Click on view results. It is scanning data dumps looking for your information. It will return results in few seconds. So here are the scanned results as my account information was exposed in one data breach. Scroll down. As you can see. My username and password was exposed in one data breach on November 4, 2022. My account password in 2020 was exactly the same as it is. It can be so dangerous hackers can use your information to exploit someone. Therefore, make sure your account credentials are secure. Second website is dhash.com. So in your browser, type dhash.com. This website will also scan data dumps on the dark web to find out your information. You can simply search your email address here. But before, you need to create an account on this website. So simply click on login. You can create an account free of cost. So click on create a new account and simply type in your email address. As I have already created an account, so I will click on login. I will type my email address and password to login. So after login, you can see the dashboard of the website. Simply type in your email address in the search bar and click on search. So here you can see my email address was exposed in two data breaches. You can also request for entry removal, but the service is paid. So our third website is haveibeenpawn.com. Open your browser and type haveibeenpawn.com. Here you can see interface of the website. Simply type in your email address and click on pond. Scroll on. Here you can see my account information is found in one data breach that occurred on November 2020 when a collection of more than 23,000 websites were breached which ended up exposing data of 226 million unique email addresses that were sold on dark web which contained email and password information of the users. So the fourth website is checklake.cc Open your browser and type checklake.cc. Here you can see the interface of the website. Click on login or register and simply sign in with Google. Choose your Google account. And on the left side, click on dehash search. Here in the search type, choose an option email. And on the left, type in your email address. And click on normal check. This website gives you two free credits to perform two searches per day. Scroll on, cancel this plan. Here you can see the search results. So it also says that your information was exposed in two breaches that occurred on November 2020. So our fifth website is uk.norton.com breach detection. Open your browser and type uk.norton.com breach detection. So this is the website, here in the search bar, type in your email address, solve this recapture and click on see your results. Here you can see my information is exposed in one data breach that occurred on November 2020. The compromised information includes email address, password and user ID. 
So these were the websites that can help you to find out your information if exposed on dark web. Thank you guys for watching my video.